This is a profile of a shaker knob. It is simply a face. Well, it's half the face because here's the center line of the shaker knob. And in SketchUp, to turn this into a three-dimensional component, we need to uh, turn this profile into that three-dimensional shape. And I'll show how to do that. First, I'll make a copy of this and move it over to the right down the red axis and then the next step is to create a path for a follow me and the path will be a circle and I've picked the circle tool and I want it to be centered on the axis on the center line and I also want it to be on the red face so I click the right arrow key to place it into the red position and then I can select the circle the path and then pick the follow me tool and bring the follow me tool over to the profile, right click, edit the group, and click, and it quickly turns the three-dimensional knob. But you can readily see that there's an issue with this knob. It's got a hole in the very tip. And in SketchUp, this happens occasionally whenever there are very small facets. So there's a way of eliminating that problem. And I'll just undo this turning and show you how to avoid that issue. And I'll select both the path and the profile and choose the scale tool and then with the diagonal corners here increase the size by a factor of 10 and I type 10 and hit return and the profile is now updated to 10 times its size to, to see that I'll click on the Zoom Extents button, which brings that into view. And now, let's turn this again by selecting the path, pick the Follow Me tool, and right-click, Edit the Group, and Turn and this time we've got a clean turning without any holes however the face color is the opposite from what we want so I'll pick all the faces here and then reverse faces and bring that back to the normal color of the outside face and we've got a then a clean knob and we to knock that back to its regular size I pick the scale tool again on these corners and type point one one tenth hit return and then zoom extents and we've got a regular size clean turning of the shaker knob